In this chapter, we will visit Elko, Nevada, Twin Falls City, Idaho, tour the Iron Horse RV Park where we stayed for a month. Hansen Bridge over the Snake River Canyon, the Niagara of the West, Shoshone Falls, Green Bridge and Snake River in Jerome, Idaho, in the Salmon Falls Creek Canyon, the world famous Balance Rock, Balance Rock Park Campground. The largest valley in the Ruby Mountains, Lamoil Canyon in Elko, Nevada. We decided to wait out the rest of the time for us to start the second leg of our 49th state tour in Elko, Nevada. So we left Las Vegas close to the end of April and spent a month in Elko. It turned out it was really good decision because by the time we left Las Vegas, we were already hitting 3-digit temperatures. The warmest in Elko for the full month was 81 degrees. We did swear that we would not be caught in Vegas in the summer anymore. Sitting at the elevation of more than 5,000 feet, Elko is known as Nevada with Altitude, a moniker to which Struel lives up. The thriving northeastern Nevada city is bordered by the towering snow-capped Ruby Mountains, often called the Alps of Nevada, and the lush glacier-carved Lamoil Canyon. And that means there's no shortage of outdoor activities to enjoy. Everything from down and dirty, ATVing to out of this world, highly skiing. Okay, let's fly the drone. There's Lucy.
Hi, good morning. It's laundry day today and I will show you the laundry room. While I am waiting for my laundry, I will show you the office. I'm done with my laundry and I'm going back to my RV. Today we are going for a two and a half hour drive to cross the state line to Idaho to visit Twin Falls City, but returning back to Elko, Nevada in the afternoon. The Hansen Bridge is a 300-foot high concrete deck girder bridge that carries Idaho State Highway 50 over the Snake River Canyon near Twin Falls, Idaho. Often referred to as the Niagara of the West, Shoshone Falls is a must attraction in Twin Falls, Idaho, at 212 feet tall and 900 foot wide. Shoshone Falls is one of the largest natural waterfalls in the United States, surpassing the heights of the famous Niagara Falls. Shoshone Falls is located on the Snake River as it curves its way through a deep basalt canyon on its way to the Columbia River. The flow of the Shoshone Falls is dependent on many variables, one of which is the amount of snowfall the region receives each winter.
Hello, Marmit! Perrin Bridge, named after the founder of Twin Falls, this bridge is 1,500 feet long and spans the beautiful Snake River Canyon. The Perrin Bridge is the 8th tallest bridge in the United States and a popular destination for base jumpers from all over the world. Guess what is immediately behind this mall? A 1,078-mile long snake river. We are now on our way to Balance Rock. This rock formation is one of the Idaho's most photographed spots. In Idaho, it seems that whenever you look, there is another weird or unique wonder to be explored. This rock formation located in southern Idaho has become a sort of state icon because of just how odd it is. Balanced Rock stands at 48 feet tall and 40 feet wide with only a 3 foot wide stem supporting it. But pictures just don't do it justice. You have to see it in person. Nearby Balance Rock Park is an excellent spot for a picnic. You can also do fishing, tent camping, RV dry camping because there's no hookups, and one rentable pavilion. No visit to the Lamoil area is complete without an expedition up to the unbelievably beautiful Lamoil Canyon Scenic Byway. This two-lane, 12-mile drive up to Canyon West, you away to 8,800 feet, following a U-shaped canyon flush with summer wildflowers and spectacular colors in the fall. On the way to the top, be sure to check out the Lamoil Glacier Overlook where you can see the result of two 1,000-foot thick glaciers that curb out this U-shaped canyon more than 250 years ago. Here, you will get a prime example of rugged glaciated peaks that tower overhead at a whopping 11,000 feet in elevation. Ruby Dome, the highest of the peaks, rises above at 11,249 which is nearly 500, 5,500 feet above the valley floor. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from me again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. We will see you in the next chapter of our 49th state tour where we will be visiting Boise, Idaho.